Tommy Chardonnay, so I, you know, um, in my product, so like I'm very taking my time on the name of it. So right. I, I'm gonna spill some. Yeah, I, I don't want like something that's like. Right. Oh, I'll be right okay. there. Here, your job with Tommy and how we're gonna take this world by storm. Make it we're gonna clean your wine. I got a big vacuum. Okay. <laughs> I think I missed that. What, what is this? Pardon me? That night, it's a five minute clearing agent. It's the only one you can use before. Make it all get to the wet. Yeah. You yeah. can do it. I mean, she'll do it. She, she's good. She'll do it. I mean, am I doing Please it right? Just keep stirring. Should I stir it? It's going to take about 45 minutes. Mm -hmm. We're going to bottle it and take it out to your car. Yes! I can't wait to do that. Okay, day. one, two. Okay, sometime. Here, you can let go of that and then come up here. And all you're trying to do is keep this sack from collapsing mm -hmm. on this so you don't want to... See, now this right here looks like some Tommy shit. That's... If y'all didn't know, that's like her hashtag. That's like her slogan or whatever. Tommy shit. And uh, that definitely looked like some Tommy shit. But that's none of my business. Anyways, what do you guys think her liquor should be called? I'm thinking maybe Tommy Tonic or... Hell, why not Tommy shit? You know? that's her brand or whatever <laughs> but anyways I think that her <laughs> having her own alcohol line is a great idea because it's like Snoop Dogg you know having his own legal weed line in weed stores or Wiz Khalifa doing a weed thing you know you have to stick with what you know and we all know that Tommy Lee loves to dry <laughs> you know she loves to, <laughs> to tap the bottle and twist the cap <laughs> That's a old school rap record for anybody who doesn't know what the hell I'm talking about. But anyways, yeah, you know, Tommy Lee drinks. That's what she likes. And she's sticking with what she knows. So you so you know she's going to be very successful at it. You know, there's, there's two things that she does well. And that's a model and drink. So I hope that she's going to be modeling the bottle. <laughs> and the bottle, in my personal opinion, should be shaped like her. Because her shape is perfecto but anyways here's what she had to say about her alcohol on instagram she said today was the finale of my first project i've never finished much in my life i'm super excited to introduce hashtag le don my new chardonnay okay so that's the name le don <laughs> my new chardonnay they say make your passion your paycheck <laughs> it's crazy that I'm, that I'm reading this now because i didn't read this before and that's exactly what i was just saying like you know to do what you know or do what you're good at that's what they say you know make your passion your paycheck and here it is can't wait for the world to sit with me hashtag tommy shit hashtag jokes on them so it's called le don the don i guess you know she's she's very very much like a mafioso type of chick stuff in, in many ways not trying to incriminate my favorite model but anyways if they don't make the bottle shape like her i'm gonna be mad but yeah, I'm going to get me two bottles. One to drink with my bad and bougie poster. And, you know, because she is the fly woman with the red dress eating the noodles <laughs> on the cover of Bad and Bougie by the Migos featuring Lil Uzi Vert. I don't like that record, but I like me some Tommy. But anyways, <clears throat> I'm going to have one to drink and I'm going to put one away as like a collector's item because I know that one of these days that damn unopened bottle of Tommy's Le Don Chardonnay is going to be worth a whole lot of shmoney. So I'm going to put it to the side. But that's just me. Anyways, I love me some Tommy. She's my favorite model. You know, I support whatever she's doing. I see her making great strides in her life. You know, a lot of y'all might say, well, this is just Tommy getting her liquor on or whatever. Listen, one day she may stop drinking. But as of right now, I think this is a great business decision because she knows a lot about alcohol, at least from what I've personally seen. I was just in her live chat room the other night and Jesus, she had herself a glass or some. But anyways, shout out to my girl, Tommy Lee. I wish her nothing but success. I'm going to give me two bottles of Ladon when it comes out. Are you going to support? Oh, by the way, <laughs> <laughs> she referred to that white dude as her wine ninja she said my wine ninja <laughs> when i say ninja i don't mean like wearing a shinobi suzuki i don't mean kuji kairi i'm talking about a ninja like n-i-g-g-a not n-i-n-j-a 
N I G G A, like ninja, you know. <clears throat> Y'all know I don't like that word. Anyway, shout out to Tommy. I love what you're doing. The joke really is on them. And you're going to be laughing all the way to the bank, like you said in your live chat recently. I was there. You had the satin bonnet on. You had a bra on. Your breasts were jumping out of the bra. Them tick old bitties. I was like, boy, she doesn't put them bazookas away. But anyways, let me know what y'all think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine, Meat Magazine 7 of Google Plus, and Meat Magazine blog on Instagram. I wish you nothing but success, Tommy. Good luck. Are you going to buy some? I know I am. Meat Magazine.